This is the unboxing of the Star Wars 74Z speeder bike drone. This is the collector edition box. So it's a special surprise when you unbox it. It's really awesome. Comes in a really nice box. See, it actually has its own serial numbers and it's sealed. It has a, a wax seal on the box. You can see the speeder bike right here on the outside. Now watch this part. This is the coolest part. Totally cool drone. Looks just like the movie. Has its own sound, lights. Acrylic case. If you do it again, it plays another theme. And it actually has a rechargeable battery for this display case. You get the sound effects. Get alongside that one. The sound effects from the movie with the speeder bikes. The music eventually stops and then you you can just pull the drone off of here. It has down facing propellers. So it's a little different getting used to fly. Um, you want to land on a flat surface, not grass. So put the props on. Looks like the controllers are sticking out of there. Nice metal um, tipped controllers for your joysticks. Very nice quality uh, remote. The note is really nice. Pretty impressive. Uh, it's got uh, altitude hold. As you can see the buttons, the joysticks go right back to the center. And you'll get a lot of sound effects when you play the, the remote. And the Emperor will give you praise for doing good when you're flying. So the controller, when you turn it on, it actually plays music. Actually, the speaker sounds pretty good. And during flight, you can choose between six soundtracks, and you'll have sound effects, and you'll have the emperor talking to you as you fly. Another couple more boxes in here. Here's the manual. Very fancy. Speeder bike manual from Star Wars. Now this is a really nice presentation here. Kind of reminds me of Apple products that come packaged so nicely. And here we have, what do we have? Wall charger. Huh. And 
Oh, little battery clips. They give you two batteries. They even look like they're part of the whole show, uh, Star Wars show. Um, nice to have two batteries and a charger. So the battery charges in this box. And they're proprietary batteries that fit right into the charger. Pop in like that to charge. Nice. And must be the wall adapter. There's the wall adapter, USB. The other flat box um, holds the prop cards. One unit prop cards. There's one more box in here. A lot of boxes in here. I'm really impressed the way it's boxed up. This is, must be my another battery. That's three batteries. That's awesome. Wow, I'm impressed. And then there's the front of your speeder bike. They give you extra parts, two extra ones, in case you break them, because they look like they could break when you run into something. Yeah, that's heavy. Let's be the wrench. Little pieces and screws. Oh, there's all kinds of parts in here. There's a set of uh, eight props. More pieces I could break to replace them. A lot of extra parts. More parts. And eight more props. Wow. Wow, they really give you a lot of parts. It's awesome. This speeder bike is pretty sweet. This is the collector edition. There's another one made by Air Hogs that's not quite as fancy as this and doesn't have the collector box and music. Yeah, I think this is going to be exciting. So with the display case, it's all lit up still um, and has sound built in. Uh, as I mentioned, you can charge this thing. There's a little charge port right there to plug in to charge the batteries in here so you can keep just showing it off or displaying it. Uh, once you put it back in the box, the light goes off, sound goes off. Very impressive. This uh, Star Wars speeder bike is really impressive. It's by Propel. They're the ones that make the real collector edition. Thanks for watching.